so this is how it goes after you must have logged into your FTS exchange app okay depending on the very coin you want to trade either you want to buy or sell you go right ahead and locate it alternatively you could just go to this search icon here go to this search icon here this is what i mean go here and then search it now you have to understand that for every coin you want to trade for every coin you you're searching for you should pay particular attention to the market where it is traded okay if it's a futures coin maybe you want to do leverage you go here if it is a sports you tap on it if it's leverage tokens you go right ahead and click on it and then you can still if you still go further you can still see more volatility we have special we have fiat and all that okay so now we just want to use um serum srom as our coin for this explanation okay so let's say i want to sell serum usd and not usdt okay remember we have and um, there, there are two parts to it we have serum serum there are two pairs we have serum usdt and we have serum usd okay but now i want to sell my serum to usd okay and not usdt so what happens is that oh sorry it just moved me to this place so fast okay so what i have to do is just look look at this serum usd okay i'm waiting for it it will have to load okay this is what i mean this serum usd okay tap on it and then wait for it to load so that it will take me to the marketplace okay so it has loaded and this is where it brought us to right so this is the chart you do your analysis remember that in this chart what is currently showing us is for a time frame so you can as well switch to other time frames you can move to one hour two hours as the case may be whatever time frame it is that is convenient for you so just to just go they just click on this four hour symbol for our okay this clock symbol it will now bring you other time frames so that you can now check your chart there to know the right place to um buy or sell okay to know what the chart is actually saying okay so now we are here and then uh, this is it so we go down we go down if you go to these trades now if you go to trade section it shows you trades that have been carried out so far okay but we are we are in order like you want we are in order we want to set an order our the order could be a buy or a sell order okay so then you come to this very place now this place the, the road price okay choose the very price you want to buy it remember our pay is usd okay choose the price you want to choose the price which you feel is convenient for either to buy or to sell either to buy or to sell okay then after i must have put the order remember this or this price now i can't just get it hypothetically you must you will arrive at it after you must have done your analysis you no know, looking at the chart to know your support and resistance and all that and all that so after you must have chosen the right place for you to place your buy or sell order in this case is actually a sale we want to sell okay let's say this is the current price and then we wish to sell at um let's say what wish to sell at three dollars okay, so it's simply to move this this order now currently is, is on buy we just move it to sell okay okay so you put your you choose the sell order remember we have buy and we have sell so we are working with sell, choose your sell order then come to this price section okay choose the price you feel it's that it is the price you want to sell at okay just tap on it to come up okay so it comes up and let's say i want to sell at three usd okay i just put three there then what amount do i want to sell okay see there is an option for the amount of srm i want to sell okay so as i'm putting the amount they will be telling me the equivalence in dollar okay what well, if i put the amount they will tell me the equivalence in dollar okay and now choose the um the type of order i want is it reduce only order is it post only or is it ioc okay but if you are if you if you really do not care about this just go right ahead put your order after i must have uh, repeated it then go right ahead and click sell you know it's not showing anything here because there is no um there is no serum here for me to sell okay that's why it's just showing me this it's just showing me this deposit collateral okay showing me this deposit collateral because there is no serum 
I I have here the thing. Okay, so that's it then. After I must have done all those to just go right ahead. In place if I had some serum here, so what is what we show here is cell. Okay. If I had serum here, so here instead of deposit collateral, I would just go right ahead and click on sell. So if the price eventually gets to this my selling price, okay, so it's it clearly executes without waiting for me to come and uh, may do anything or all that on anything. Okay, it just clearly sells on its own. So that's just how you place a sell order. The same thing is also applicable to your buy order. Same thing applies to your buy order. After you must have done your analysis, you've chosen where you feel the price is okay or where you should buy or the best support to buy. Okay, so put it, put the figure here exactly whatever it is that the chart showed you. Maybe say two dollars is the best support for you, and then click on the quantity you want to buy, the amount, you, amount of serum you intend buying, and all that too. And once you put the amount you want to buy, remember this is what I'm talking about this amount once you put the amount of serum you want to buy on that here calculate the usd equivalence and then you go right ahead and click on buy okay so that's how this is done it's a very simple process so this is just how to place a buy and sell order on the um, fts exchange so maybe on subsequent videos we'll be looking at some of these things we'll be looking at some of these other what they mean and how you can use them and also we we'll also this type of um also consider types of orders as well because there are various types of orders okay we have limit order market order and all that so we'll consider them in a subsequent video but basically the essence of this class is just to show us a simple way of um, placing a buy and sell order on fts exchange okay Okay, so until I come your way again, I remain Mr. Solution. Please, if you're not subscribed to my YouTube channel, kindly subscribe and I'll be happy to see you in another video.